What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Blue Fox 22 coming. What is going on with my keys? There we go. All right. I'm coming up with you with another episode. Today, we are going to be working on Bawa because uh, we need storage, we need power, we need automation. Um, I'm fiddling around with pipes. Um, I'll explain the rundown of everything in a minute after I get established what we're doing today. But, um, I realized that pipes is actually installed in the mod pack. Um, and also we have the spiritual successor successor for 1.8 of uh, storage drawers, which is functional storage. So functional storage has the storage controller. And I figured I would set something, some slight automation up. So that way we're constantly pumping out, um, we're filling up our system with coal, hence the uh, universal pipes, because item pipes like to connect to item pipes and it's it's annoying trying to get the logistics right and you have pipes that are all the same color. So universal pipes are pretty expensive, but resource wise for right now, they're a godsend. So um, the way universal pipes work through the pipes mod is it transfers not only items, but fluid, energy, and gases all at once. Um, so the way I have this set up, this is drawing or pulling, um, tells you right here with the advanced pipe upgrade installed. Uh, it's pulling 32 items every five ticks. It transfers um, 2000 millibuckets or two buckets of fluid every tick. It transfers over 32,000 FE or 327 uh, KFE, I believe could be wrong but uh it transfers there are 32,000 fe every tick and transfers eight millibuckets or eight buckets of gas every tick so the universal cables early on are pretty pretty good even without the upgrade um we're still transferring four items every to every 20 ticks we're you know it's pretty 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 good um gold the upgrades are gold um let's actually pop up pipes and Uh, standard, gold, diamond, ultimate, and then uh, infinite pipe upgrades. So now we should stop taking coal. Let me get some, um, upgrades aren't cheap, but they're not hard to make. Luckily I had some decent resources already set up. So we weren't, I wasn't out mining for 19 years. Blacklist, add coal. And we gotta do this. Oh, all right, I'm gonna do this and then I will meet you back upstairs. All right, sit tight. Okay, I'm back. Oh, I didn't wanna do that. Like I promised, lock it on normal. I'm so glad I made sure that was on normal, not hard. All right. So it's gonna be a little laggy because they're doing to do some mob gens. I'm going to go to sleep. No, no. Uh, I gotta put this away. Uh, bubbles, angel ring. It'll be weird not being able to fly, but it is what it is. So, I've gone adventuring <laughs> in between episodes, and I found a lot of stuff. Preferably a lot of spell books. If this wasn't, you know, a clue, nor this. So, I'm gonna go to sleep. I enchanted pretty much everything that I could possibly enchant. Uh, I have to put my angel ring away because, I mean, I, I mean, it's insane to get an angel ring in this game. Like, even a diamond ring is insane to get in this game. All the modium, you need two blocks of that. You need four blocks of unobtainium. Unobtainium, yeah, it's in the end. <laughs> it's unobtainium for a reason. So first off, we need some lapis or we need some um, just blue dye. So I figured we'll go do a little bit of exploring. I'll show you guys the area. My fuel farm, love bamboo.
So I'm thinking about upgrading my other iron backpack so that three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I forgot to put that ninth block of dirt. Um, so that I have one backpack that, um, pretty much gathers up resources and all that. And I don't have to worry about it. Oh, I need a boo-boo. I forgot. I need food. The other thing I want is the auto feed upgrade for the backpack and the inception upgrade for the backpack. That way we can get a whole bunch of... Hmm. Thought I had you... Linking tool, configuration tool. Configuration tools, pretty straightforward. You just need an emerald. The linking tool is the same recipe. It's just swapping out for a diamond. you set to so you shift right click and it will switch modes for you item render show upgrade render locking and show amount okay, there we go all right so um yeah we'll figure that out but uh we need is this what i need corn flour yes i can actually use that we'll get a whole bunch of these for now sorry for the lag everybody like I said, the game is having a fit, and it's mystical gray flower. I don't want any mystical flowers just yet. Get some dandelions going. I know I can bone meal this, the ground, to get other things, but I'm going to hold off on all that. Oxide daisies will give us, I think, white or light gray. I'm not mistaken. Yeah, light gray dye. Which is actually a pretty popular dye, other than white, blue, and red, and yellow, of course. Um, might as well get more flowers. Eh, vein mine. So yeah, uh, I made a steel paxel, no, osmium paxel, because I had uh, enough osmium left over. So we got an osmium paxel, we have a iron sword steel, but like I said, I found so many books or just loot with stuff on it i'm like you know what let's see what we can do work some magic here and get these enchantments to either merge and grow together you know and to get stronger together or what we'll figure it out but uh over here are the raw ores that cannot be processed just through smelting they either have to in this case all the modium or um wasn't it didn't even have a recipe yet as far as what I can do with it. But, um, now that I figured everything out, okay, now it does have a recipe. This didn't have a recipe before, so I guess they updated the mod pack. So I'm gonna hold off because most of these need macerated anyway, except for the only things I won't do are the uranium and um, the plutonium, I believe, plutonium. No, it's just uranium. We need corn flour to make blue dye. I might as well process these. And we'll get this going. So we have light gray dye, we have yellow dye, and we have some blue dye. Let us jump in. We need to first make some... I want the coal generator first, but in order to get the coal generator, we need a machine frame. Machine frame, simple. It's iron, gold, or iron, blue dye, and gold nuggets. We need to have everything but the gold nuggets. Luckily, I thought ahead, and we can make a whole bunch of gold nuggets. Uh, a lot of recipes call for gold nuggets, so I'm making a lot on purpose. <laughs> so let's go ahead and we'll do this. We'll make a couple of these. I uh, need more blue dye. Great. We got three for now, so that'll, that'll be okay. Uh, we need redstone torches. Why are you giving me tiny redstone? Stop giving me tiny redstone. Where are my sticks? Do I not have any sticks in here? I knew I had sticks in here. What are you doing, game? Just gonna make a whole bunch of these. Got enough redstone. I use all my... I must have used all my broken down redstone. Yeah. Not a problem. I don't need that much. 
do that for now. Like I said, I gave myself a lot of resources, but it's not a lot. It's not. It's only enough to keep us afloat. It's not enough to keep us throughout the entire game. All right, so now we can make our coal generator. I'm gonna make, should I make two or just one? I'll make one for now. But I think, yeah, we'll make one for now. And then I wanna get a sterling dynamo. Sterling dynamo needs iron, iron gear, any kind of stone and a redstone flux coil. Redstone flux coil is an iron ingot and two redstone. Just make a whole bunch of these to save yourself some time. Uh, automation, it's little stuff like this that I, I automate first. That way I never have to deal with it again. Uh, we can get rid of that. Iron gear, just need an iron nugget. I never run into recipes that need a lot of iron, iron nuggets, so I'm not gonna make a lot. Because we don't really have a lot of iron. That's quartz, not iron. Iron's down here. It's an alphabetical order, goofball. Come on then, use your brain. Uh, this year, the rest of this year is going to be crazy, guys. Uh, me and Mandy, we finally found a place we're moving. Um, we're going to have our own house. And I'm going to have my own room again dedicated for... You know all the recording stuff until it is time for us to start our family and then i'll gladly give up the room again so that our baby has a place to sleep <laughs> but um yeah it, it, it's time that we got our own and everything and hopefully everything works out um as soon as we move and um we get set up i'll do a house tour for you guys it's not that big of a house but it, it, it'll be ours and there's, I have a lot of future plans set up for everything. All right, so now we have our coal generator. Um, let's set this downstairs. And I'm gonna use, actually, let's route this out. I wanna use that corner of this, this corner of the room again. Uh, we'll put the coal generator in the floor. My knees, oh. Oh, my knees. I forgot about this hole. And I can't fly. <laughs> oh, luckily I can nerd pull my way up there if I need to. But I'm going back down to the basement anyway, so... My knees! Um, coal generator can convert coal and blocks of coal to power. Okay. So, I guess he won't use charcoal. <gasps> He uses charcoal. Uh, recipe. What can I do to make charcoal? And then wood. You're using wood. <laughs> That's not a problem, though, because instead of bamboo, let's break this. So I'm going to clear you out. Set you there. I'll clear you out. Dump all this bamboo back in there. So let us route this out. I want to use the storage drawer for. Uh, store, let's get a storage drawer controller again. Storage drawer controller. I need two storage drawers and a redstone comparator. Okay. Uh, storage drawer controller. You. You. Redstone comparator. Any, I just need any storage drawer. Doesn't matter what kind. I need one or two, two. And we need any kind of stone and block of quartz. <coughs> Use me. That came out of nowhere. Luckily, I have quartz. And I should have some stone. Is 
Did I not? There we go. We got some stone. Okay. What was I? I know I have some stone. What's going on here? Store, store controller. We need this. And I'm going to need another furnace. I'll use a blast furnace. It doesn't matter. Sugarcane can go away. Phantom membrane can go away. Coal can go away. Cobblestone can get put away. I'll keep that machine frame. We got the coal gen done. We got the iron gear we got done. We'll do the squeezer next because I want to see if we can use that to double stuff. For right now. Ah, Gary, eat the pulverizer. Forget that. We'll get the squeezer if I need it. I do have to make another machine frame though. Another type of machine frame. We're gonna do a blast furnace, and then we're gonna go. Storage for controller. Thinking to you, to you. Okay. And then now I can do. Come from under here. We'll go underneath first. I want to go from the storage floor. I want to go from here to there. And I want to draw from there. And I'm going to need a filter. Luckily, I have a whole bunch. two of these because I want two filters and I'm going to get another chest to be on the safe side. There we go. Okay. So I'll deal with all that later. It just sucks because it's not, it doesn't automatically take it off because of sightedness and that's just really weird. Okay. So I want this to only take out charcoal. What are I doing my charcoal? What did I do with my charcoal? And the charcoal, where'd you go? Hmm. I must have threw it all in there. Yep. A piece of that. Okay, so let's set up our pipes first and then we'll add the charcoal. So from here to here, I want you add charcoal submit. So this will only take charcoal. This is your whitelist. Or no, 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 no. I have to do that the other way around. Uh, no, that's right. That's right. Because I'm going to use wood. So we're going to put wood in here. And then I want this to take charcoal. I should get another one of these. Probably not. Let's get another compacting drawer. Everything but you. Let's get another compacting drawer. I'm gonna set that up right there. Because I want this to. Output charcoal and accept wood. And we're gonna go like that. Completely block that off. You're going to accept charcoal. And then I just gotta remember to keep that stocked with wood. What is abundant around here? 
Looks like oak. Yeah, it looks like oak. Uh, I got oak logs on me. So I can use oak logs to make charcoal. Unless it's just for a blasting furnace. Faster to do this. Can you not go in a blasting furnace? No! <laughs> no, you cannot. Sorry, regular furnaces only. Uh, I don't have any regular furnaces. It's over here. All right, where's my where's my cobblestone? Not a problem. I can make another chest. I could have swore that would work. Just goes to show how rusty I am with vanilla Minecraft. Okay, so you're extracting. Can I do this? Yes, I can. Okay. So, you, you. No. You. Add wood, Minecraft oak log, or invert. Submit. So now you won't take that. Okay, so let us connect you. Move. Add. Remove. Okay, I guess it's green because it has items in it. Okay, so this is going to pump out into there. Did that actually work this time? Uh, I should say three. Yes! All right, perfect. All right, okay. So, now I need to add logs to this. Now I'm going to say, hey, you, take these logs from here and put them in there. Or no, that's, that's, that's bad. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that. Hold on, oh, hold on. Can break that. And we'll do that. <clears throat> so annoying that I can't fly. And we'll do that. And I'm gonna tell this. Uh the opposite. So I want this. So I want this to be the opposite of the other one. So I want coal inverted logs enabled. So we will do you. We will. Add a log. At least I know it works. All right. Uh, give me all these real quick. You add log, regular, submit, add, charcoal, invert, submit. Okay, so that's the opposite of this one. Okay. So now, I'm gonna add logs to that. And that takes it. 
Okay, sweet. Now! <laughs> do this and this. Disable that. No, don't, don't, don't do that. What are you, but, what, what, what? What do you turn into? Graphite and gets from bigger reactors. Oh. Okay. Good thing I don't plan on making an infinite loop where that happens. Um, you need to be configured to, to only take in logs. So I need another one of you. And the cool thing is I can do this. No, I have a key. Okay, so now that this is like this, I can add, I can put you, and I can say, um, submit, and then I'll take that out. Oh, I forgot how much hunger using that kills. I forgot how much I'm um, using Veinmon kills my hunger. I almost said that backwards. All right. Um, we have our filter. So let's see if this will work. Because now I need to do this. I need to tell this to do this. As long as this, ooh, I didn't lock these. Damn it. And we're gonna have some charcoal going for a while. Got a decent bit of wood. This is gonna burn for a long time unless we upgrade this into an iron furnace. Um, the iron furnace, stone to iron furnace upgrade is literally cobblestone and iron. So we'll bump this up. We'll do one and bump this up. Yeah, we'll bump this up. Um, iron to gold. Oh, that's expensive. Get ourselves a gold, a gold furnace for over here. I don't know why it spit out its inventory. That was weird. Ah, oh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, auto input on, auto output not on. <laughs> um, top we can extract. Top will, uh, top we will input. Top will be an input. Bottom will be both. Input and output. Because it's ignored. Okay. So we're golden. This is now automated. And in between episodes, I'm going to work on this and automate this. So now that I have golden furnaces, I can do auto inputs. I don't know why I didn't think of using the furnaces first. Like this was a lifesaver. So yeah, this is, this is awesome. So we can input on the top and input and output on the bottom, which is exactly what we need right now. I think all of our wood is split though. But hey, we're we're golden for now. So that's gonna fill up up top. As soon as this is maxed out. And this is gonna keep 
um, you know, filling up power. I can put an upgrade in this to speed it up at least. We can remove that. And we can just put that in there to speed it up. And then this will be, this will backlog. And then as soon as this backlogs, this should stop. This should pause. So we should be good. So we have power generation going now. We need storage. So let us um, get a redstone furnace and a pulverizer going. Um, I honestly want the pulverizer first. We just need a machine frame that requires iron, tin, and glass. Something that, things that I'm pretty sure we have. But you know what? I'm going to call in an episode for today. And when we come back, we'll get our pulverizer and our redstone furnace up and running. I don't really need us. We don't need a sterling dynamo right now. Let's get it. Let's get it just to be on the safe side. Um, it's actually really cheap to make. We can actually probably make that right now. <laughs> Uh, only thing we don't have is the iron gear. Like that real quick. Let's make a couple. And then we should be good to make that. And then I'm going to set this up like this. We'll hold off on the Sterling Dynamo setting that up just yet, but we have it. It's ready to go. Um, Sterling Dynamo works by, uh, it, it just burns stuff. So if you've never used a Sterling Dynamo before, it generates 40 RF a tick. Um, it generates flux using solid, any solid fuel, anything that can burn, you can put in here. And through that burning process, it generates um, fuel. I don't know what augments can go in here, so we'll figure that out. We'll go figure that out. Wireless heat, wireless heat receiver. Has yet to be bound to an energy source. Place in the fuel slot of the furnace only works from iron tier and above. Oh. Oh. We can transfer heat using power. Throughout this block with forge energy in it will power all wireless heat receivers that are bound. Oh, we can have powered furnaces early. And then we can get the blasting augments. Okay. We're definitely going with iron furnaces soon. Not right now, but soon. All right. So the Sterling Dynamo is going to be good for our quarry. Because we have quarry plus installed. We also have FTB industrial contraptions. I never played with that. So Yeah, iron furnace, uh, nuclear reactor chamber. I think this is like a AE2 variant. Yeah, quantum helmet. Not AE2, um, I see. Oops, sorry, hit the mic. But, um, yeah, there's a thermal gen, the windmill, solars, has the battery boxes. Yeah. Okay. So that's another industrial pro uh, mod for us to play around with. So this is what the uranium's for. More than likely. Okay. Feed the beast. Protein bar. <laughs> Can food? I don't want to know. All right, let's get off of here. Um, but yeah, we do need we do need um, we 
We do need a quarry, but the quarry plus mod is this this thing uses so much power. Uses so much power. All right, ladies and gentlemen. All right, ladies and gentlemen, sorry about that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for tuning in. As always, I'm your host, Michael Gardner, a.k.a. Blue Fox 22 I'm going to take the cow head off. Don't worry. It will be gone. Don't worry. All right, ladies and gentlemen, with that said, thank you so much for tuning in. As always, stay safe, stay as healthy as humanly possible, and above all, stay foxy. Uh, don't worry. This video will not be an hour long. I'm going to cut a lot of it out, cut a lot of it down, and uh, we'll get, uh, we're getting there. Uh, next episode, we're going to finish up and get our redstone furnace and our pulverizer. The redstone furnace I want because there's only certain there's certain recipes that only the redstone furnace can do. Um, and it's a powered furnace, so we don't have to waste resources to smelt stuff anymore. We can just throw it in the redstone furnace, let it go, and go from there. But I think... Um, our main thing now that we're going to need is power storage. And I think the best mod to use is our tools power, in my opinion. Even the low grade stuff, um, like this holds 500,000 RF. That's what it holds. And that's just one block. So it, it is pricey, but even the low tier is still worth it. Um, and then we have, whoa, blazing generator, blazing aggregator, blazing infuser. Okay. Then we got the dimensional cells. This block can store power optionally, uh, optionally in a big multi-dimensional structure, multi-dimensional structure. This block stores power and can be combined with other cells to form a big multi-block. Right click with a wrench to toggle input slash output mode for a side. So yeah. We're 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 in the money. We're in the money. I do want to get the uh, the endermatic generator up and running again. I haven't played with that in forever. The endermatic generator is broken. <laughs> so uh power level blocks block shows a digit representing the amount of power in something. It all says sends out a redstone signal with the same amount. Oh. Okay. All right. And then uh, I think the next video after that, we're going to jump back in and start playing with the mod pack itself. I think we're going to go with logistics and do refined storage. I think because the first task for that is just making your controller. Um, and then I think we're gonna get into mystical agriculture because we, I haven't done anything with mystical agriculture yet. So, especially in the newer mythical agriculture, but I really do wanna get into tinkers. Um, elemental craft, maybe. But I do wanna get into tinkers. Um, and elemental craft. We messed around with Batania before, but not the newest but, uh, version of Batania. I think elemental craft is going to be one, something that we're going to work with. But uh, all right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. As always, stay safe, stay, stay as healthy as only possible, and above all, stay foxy. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you all in the next episode of Minecraft. Take care. If this is a wonderful day and or night, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. I'll also run down, I'll do a better rundown of my gear in the next episode. All right, bye-bye.